Welcome back, Fluffle FBB here, and it's a part. Yep, just a couple days ago I did the, I did the review on the Armitian Chameleon, and today I had took it out flying, and I took a crash, a very bad crash. Um, I was diving into one of the barns at my flying spot. I'll see if I can find a clip showing how what I was doing, and. I punched to full throttle. Note, uh, note this was on four cell, and I'm still going to use two four cell power. And I rised up into one of the rafters, hit square on, and I destroyed just about every part on the chameleon. <clears throat> now, none of the actual electronics were harmed. Or I take it back. The VTX was harmed. The VTX was damaged. But other than that, everything, all the electronics were. We're just fine. <clears throat> so let's, let's look at that damage. So the main plate, you might be able to see, let's see. but that part, this part right here, one of those toes got pretty delaminated and nasty. But the main thing is right here. So this is the, this is with the non-damaged story. And yeah, I cracked the plate. So I should be getting this one tuned. Now onto these two parts. As you can see, that hole got the screw. The screw pulled out the hole. So yeah. Um. Next part. This one's gonna be a little bit harder to see. But you should be able to see that that's a little bit bent. That's not the main thing. Uh, it doesn't show up very well, but the this this uh, part right here actually is slightly bent. So when I tighten it down onto the frame, it'll it angles out slightly. So it, not much. It may or may not be an issue, but that's another damaged part. This part got damaged too, and doesn't look like it's gonna show up. But I got it cracked right along here, as well as right where the, this hole is on both sides. Now the final part that got damaged was these braces. Yep, they look nothing like what they should. <laughs> this hole should be way down, like right here. And there shouldn't there shouldn't there shouldn't be a bump. That's that that shouldn't be there. Yeah. <laughs> so now with this being said, sure, just about every part got damaged, but it took an insanely hard hit. Uh, I mean, I don't think any other frame would have survived this. Maybe, possibly. Something along the lines of a of the Armitian F15, F16, the F1 series, just because of I I feel like the arms are a little bit more robust. That being said, I ha I have not owned one of these frames, so I can't say for sure, but they look like they would have stood up maybe a little bit better. But on a crash like this. Uh, that top plate, I'll post a picture up now. But the top plate would have probably gotten uh, cracked and completely annihilated. And uh, with with Armitan, that wouldn't be warranted. Anyway, this was just a quick video showing the crash damage. And please like, subscribe, and see you next time.